Wednesday. Did you know it? Did you feel it? Yeah. I'm excited. Yep. Aren't you, Tom? Well, yeah, because we got to get in a workout. I don't even think I know how to work out. And then Ariel Orsuda always joins us on Wednesday because she always follows sports for us, but also as a certified personal trainer and fitness instructor, she's helping to at least give us the option of staying fit. Not all of us are taking it, Ariel. Some of us are just static people. <laughs> But a lot of people are excited about what you can show them what they can you know, do while at home. Yeah, it's just a gentle push. I'm not forcing anything on you, but I'm here in case you'd like that gentle push. Last week, I introduced you to one of the forms of interval training. That was HIT training with Tabata timers. I'm going to do a different type of acronym this time, it's EMOM training. Now I feel like Tom would have had a joke about EMOMs with you know electronic moms or something. So I'm gonna kind of put the kibosh on that right away. This is every minute on the minute. That's that type of training. So what that means, you need a timer of some sort. You need your watch or you need a phone, something with a one minute timer. So you're gonna do an exercise for a few number of reps, whatever it designates on the workout. I have this one written online and on Facebook so you can follow along that many reps and in the minute. As soon as the next minute starts, you do the next workout. So I'll demonstrate, ready? Here we go. One minute timers here. We have to do 10 weighted squats, okay? Weights right here, heavy weights. Go down, do 10. I think this might've been 15 in the workout that I have written, but I'm just gonna do a few right here just for a demonstration. Okay, let's say we get to the end of this and we'll just call this one right here 10 or 15, whichever one that was. And we still have time left on here, okay? I designate if you're standing, you have to spend the rest of that minute in a standing squat. If it were to have been something that we would have been on the ground, you have to then be in a plank. So I'll show you one of those. Another one of the workouts, right? I'm gonna cancel this one. We'll start another minute, okay? Let's say that the minute was up and here we go. On the minute, buzzer right there. We're gonna go down and we're gonna do push up to renegade row. I know I gotta be back here so you can see me. Okay, ready? Push up, pull back into a row. Push up, back into a row. Do that five times each side till you get to 10 total. Then again, you finish early, you still have time left on your timer. 30 seconds, hold that plank until you're done, until the next timer comes. Then I'm sure there's a cardio right there, then there's another one. This one had me so out of breath today. We went from different weights up top, different weights on the bottom, core, cardio, everything. It's all on Facebook and it's all online. That's awesome. That's great. I, it looks like a lot of work to me, but <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's the point. I'm out of practice now. It's influencing me. I, I'm just, just saying she's had a big influence. There we go. Um, Oh, I still have the tags on these. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's actually a makeshift weight that I'm using in my home studio, but you know, I might pick them up one day. The good news is the tag means it weighs more, right, Ariel? <laughs> hey, you know what? You can make weights with anything. My cat was just in here a second ago and I, he's 16 pounds. I was going to pick him up and start squatting with him. <laughs> I've got a pen. All right, I'm done. <laughs> Make it work. Ariel, we like Workout Wednesday. We will see you at the latest next Wednesday. Thanks. Speaking of exercise, today Peloton brought back